channel. Three rounds to determine one clear winner. This is Iron Rounds. And if you guys love the content, share, like, and subscribe. Join the No Press fam and help us grow our channel. With that said, let's go. Round one, Space Gap. All right, let's start. Let's start off with Bane. And so, you guys, if you guys don't already know, it should be pretty obvious. But if you guys don't know already, round one, Space Gap, meaning range, meaning distance. If you, if the opponents were to meet up from a far away range shot, who would have the upper hand? Let's start off with Bane. The man faces Batman and gunfire on several occasions, and he manages to dodge both even with his larger stature. He has also, with the Venom, been able to toss objects way above any human level strength. Also is a strategist, and a very intelligent one. He can think himself out of a jam during a brawl, combining strength like no other, speed to avoid rain shots, and the brains to come up with his own way of putting down Kingpin with a long range distance shot, and he might have this one. Now let's talk about Kingpin's pros. The man is also known to be pretty fast in reflexes himself. Surprising, right? As he usually battles people of such high calibrations like Daredevil and Spider-Man. Yeah. This might appear cheatsome, but Kingpin has been known to hire others to do his dirty work. So if he couldn't get the necessary shot at distance, he could always call Bullseye to take the shot for him. He also is a strategist, so even if he didn't have the long range capabilities, he can always find a way around the issue and have his chance for victory. Ultimately, there has to be one clear winner in this round, and my pick is Bane. This doesn't necessarily come down to who can nail who with a tough enough object, but rather who can endure the punishment of having things tossed at them and giving Bane has taken over 300 bricks to the face at once. It's safe to say he has the stronger pain tolerance, and after that, it becomes a who will fall under the weight of all that tossings, and it looks like Kingpin would give first. All right. Round two, face to face. Let's talk about Bane's pros. The man fights a bad family member quite a bit. So there is no questioning whether or not if he can get down with Kingpin because he clearly can. Wilson Fisk, is, he can give him a reward for his money. He also has the brains to match him in a close quarter battle and the skills to put some damage to the big boss man. I'll leave the flex of breaking Batman's spine to drive my point home. As you know, Batman has been said to be one of the most knowledgeable humans when it comes to mastering almost every form of hand-to-hand -hand combat. If he took him down out of commission, I'm sorry to say Kingpin doesn't stand a chance against the skills, the brains, and the strengths that Bane is. Now let's talk about Kingpin's pros. Defeated Daredevil on a few occasions and has mastered sumo wrestling amongst others at the most highest level. This is to assure you martial arts isn't gonna be enough. His brain has the capabilities of pinpointing weaknesses during a fight, which means he could spot an opening from pain at some point, sorry, from Bane at some point throughout the, their brawl. His strength is out of, the, out of this world crazy, and that's without any venom to boost his strength. The man has crushed skulls and all sorts of materials that would be deemed impossible to crush even at our real world's strong person standards. Ultimately, ultimately though, there has to be one clear winner in this round, and my pick is Kingpin. In this round, it's not about fighting skills more than it is about gripping skills. Between the two, Kingpin has known, has been shown way more gripping skills. He has crushed Captain America almost in half one time and has held both Daredevil and Spider-Man in his hands, separate hands, both separate hands, while Bane could barely hold onto Cheetah. Cheetah is a top tier level person so that's true but so is spider-man if you want to make strength comparison a claim they're both they both can dish out impressive reflexes and skills but when it's all said and done the fight up close would probably lead to a muscle match and bane is strong but kingpin is naturally stronger so i'll give this round to kingpin 
All right, guys, now we're down to round three. Who takes it home? All right, let's start off with Bane's pros. We're pulling out all the stops for this one, leaving nothing out to call this one. I'm talking, of course, the Venom Serum. This, if you don't know, makes Bane increased his strength to super level abilities and beyond any ordinary person could do. This serum also makes it harder for things to penetrate his body at times because of the mass. This surpasses Kingpin's strength quite a lot, allowing him a chance to overpower him during their encounters and maybe even manhandle him throughout the fight. You add that with his intellect, hand-to-hand -hand combat skills, and his credentials fighting other beings with greater strength, like Killer Croc, for example, and managed to break his arm, and I believe that was without the venom, so put those together and you got an unstoppable force. Bane with time can also get a few guys to work Kingpin over before taking his shot, as he did to the Dark Knight, but those guys would have to be some serious heavy hitters and Kingpin usually fights martial artists on a regular to keep himself in peak physical conditions. Still, a wave of men thrown at anyone would take a toll without a gift of superpowers. Now let's talk about Kingpin. Speaking of unstoppable forces, Kingpin isn't no lightweight when battling heavy hitters with greater strength than he has like Captain America and Spider-Man, and even the Winter Soldier to name a few. He can definitely give Bane a run for his money in a back-to-back -back exchange, but what adds to this untouchable from the law man is his superior cane weaponry. He can f fool him with duplicates of himself and then surprise him with a thunderous blow or hit him with an elect one of those electric blasts and see if that puts a dent on the master wrestler. Either way, it does provide much needed assistance to put Bane in his place. All else fails, he can uh, he has the time. If he had the time, he could hire a few goons to help him slow down or finish Bane for him. With his power and money and strength, he would be considered the favorite to win this. Ultimately, there has to be one clear winner of this round, and my pick is Bane. Both are genius intellect, both can learn opponents' weaknesses, and both are skilled in their profession, like Kingpin with sumo wrestling and Bane with professional wrestling. But who's gonna last is the question. Bane has the serum to increase his strength and stamina, while Kingpin relies only on his daily workout and training to maintain his fire. At some point, Kingpin will have to give, and not to mention Kingpin isn't known to get his hands dirty as often, while Bane has been as it's since he's been doing this since he was an infant, making his grittiness that much more tougher to put down. So yeah, ultimately, Bane's got this one. But as always, no press fam, if you guys agree or disagree with my argument, you guys can either hashtag Bane or hashtag Kingpin. Um, whichever, if you agree with my argument, you know, you just show some love with Bane, just hashtag Bane. But if you guys disagree with my argument, you can hashtag Kingpin, make your point, And if it's valid and respectful enough, maybe it might change my mind and I might switch the characters to the next round for Kingpin. But you gotta tell me in advance. You gotta let me know soon because obviously in the next couple weeks, I will be doing new episodes of these characters. And as always, no press fam we really appreciate you guys keeping it 600 subs peace shout out to all my content supporters not working together but we like to give credit where credit is due ivan the unstoppable for all the knowledge of comic feats watch mojo for origins and for all the background videos comic historian comics explained and key issues go ahead and check them out and tap into the world of comics by supporting other creators. Link to channels will be in the description below.